Hello, welcome to The Ghost & Co. Today, we are investigating the historic Donna Courthouse. The courthouse was built in 1937, where it both housed and sentenced prisoners. The courthouse has attracted the public and the paranormal investigators. In the 1950s, a waitress named Mary Waters was found near the Amador Hotel and brought to the jail under the assumption that she was drunk. Once Mary was placed in the cell, she screamed and was found dead in her cell with a horrified look. The coroner's report cites of a ruptured kidney for Mary's cause of death, later modified to include alcohol poisoning. Some say that Mary's spirit remains in this jail today. There has been many reports of mysterious slamming of the heavy cell doors, cold spots, feeling of being followed, and more. Now follow us and to see if these claims are true or simply just a rumor. Yeah, I, I forgot my K2. Uh, you can go in any of the doors, sit down, do your thing. Uh, there's a steel door back here in this back hallway that goes into the doctor's offices. And then another door, steel door, that leads out to an interior courtyard. This is their exercise yard. You can't see it from the street. You got two doors to get into there. So um, that's the deal there. Cell block two is this one. It's a full size. It's, it's Everything's complete in it. It's got that door that... Uh, Zach and them were trying to get close. It's right here, the handle's on the outside. It's also got a series of two doors here with the handle on the outside. You can crank shut, crank open. Uh, these have um, tables, these have bunk beds. And so you'll know you're in cell block two. A lot of activity there, we'll have a lot of people talk, basically all over this damn building, but this, this area here seems to be really active. Um, they've seen women here, they've seen, I saw the shadow guy here, middle of the day, I heard the jail door slam for the fifth time. I come in thinking it's a homeless guy. I had a big military <laughs> flash. So I was going to beam the dude with. So I walked up here and I passed here. I was always checking this back door here. And I see this guy standing here and he's, he's thin. He's about six feet. He's got his legs spread. And he's got his hands down, but all in the shadow. I thought immediately it was a homeless guy. So I look back again. He's still standing there. And then he sidesteps into this jail, which I know is a oh, dead great. end. I go chasing it. As soon as I turn in here, it's like it ran through a refrigerator. I think you're just fucking with me. Uh, just giving my attention. You just went red. So, yeah. anyway, I don't expect you to remember this, but you can come back in here, turn on the light, okay. or review the map, okay? Yeah. These are the doors that slam shut. You can feel them. They don't move very easily. This is the sheriff's mansion. I was telling you about It's amazing. Rooms back in through there. These are all holding big holding cells. You get a chance to go into this. This is cell block one. There's three cells down to the fourth one's closed. We've got to open it up again. This guy's really good at prison art. You go inside the cells. Um, this is cell block two. Two ways to enter it. It's a, it's a long hallway. Turn right, turn right. Or you come in this way. What's that? Hey, go that you heard that too? Yeah. All right. Here it goes again. Um, 
I'm going to cut you through the uh, back way over here so you can kind of get an idea. We just heard like tap. Yeah, it's a little tap. Go ahead. Somebody saw a woman over here in the corner crying, and another older lady over here, different times, different years, saying either the rosary or chanting. They couldn't make it out which. We're going to cut through here. Because I saw you, Jim. Yeah, like right on the right side. Jeez. I didn't take that notice. I just. Chairs out, they're all bolted together, the old style chairs here in the next room here. Uh, they moved twice uh, out in an arc over here. Two of us pushing back. So someone had a lot of here. Jumped at five when I walked in there. Oh, yeah. The uh, meeting came in with a, one of the paranormal investigators. She didn't know the building. She was out of state visiting a friend. Came over. She walked in here and told Vicki, one of the paranormal persons, Says Vicky, there's a man standing here who wants me to tell you he has a white shirt on. So it's the guy I wear. But anyway, watch your step down here. Back in the day, the building has changed a little bit. There used to be a wall here with the door. This was the judge's a law library. This was the attorney's law library. That's where that you know things crawled across the floor and raised up. Where you run over to the east lane right now? Here, a little girl's voice clears. I'm talking to you, saying, Can you see me? And I couldn't, and I don't answer. Uh, about two years ago, uh, I was staring out that window over there in the uh, judge's uh, courtroom, and during the day, you can see all the way through because it has windows on that side. I saw a guy, someone from back here, walk past this window, this window, this window, heading out that way. We used to keep that glass door closed and locked. I said, Well, there's somebody over there. We go out and lock it. Of course, nobody here, but he. Thin built guy, Hispanic. He had a buzz top haircut like 1940s, and a white shirt and a thin black tie and black slacks. Never seen him again. But no, I did see him through that one particular day. Probably showed up court class. <laughs> okay, we're going to the third floor. for a three-state area for men, women, and juvies. It's one of the signs. Uh, the way it worked is these lines here were the bars. That was an opening. This was the women's section, 20 bunk beds, kitchen, and men's section, 20 bunk beds, and the juvies back over here. That uh, room I was talking about is right here. Mark and Stanley, John Clancy. Yes, you can see a 
We can do tours like wrapping it up kind of thing. If it, or what do you? What yeah, whatever you, you, whatever you guys do. What time do you do? Is it eleven? Is it eleven? It's eleven o'clock. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so, I mean, we go down to the basement about ten. You want to do that? Yeah. Right. So it gives us like an hour to go down there. Yeah. He said it's nighttime. It's time to go to sleep. Phone call, no storage. 
It's called the secret room. Secret room. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, hey, we get some right here. Hey, buddy. Uh, it's an old cobble room. Oh, it's still going. It's not like there's wire coming through. Yeah, I was about to say, you can even put it up against the wall. It's not doing that. It's gone now. It's all in. It's not happening. It's literally right here in between. How you doing? Actually, I think he's on top of me. Samuel Adams right there? Or is that Bud Light? It's Bud Light. <laughs> They just had a zombie thing. Yeah, that's what little fundraiser. Yeah, like a little fundraiser for kids, the zombie night, you know? Um, yeah. People jump out and scare you, you know, sort of like my half. It is an actual bathroom. They need to clean up in here. This damn thing is dirt. Oh. Oh. There it is. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. It's a clean bathroom, okay? It's Let the man use the bathroom and then I'll tell you, it's clean. Yeah, it's All right, hey. Dang. Next time, can you please shut the door? <laughs> Hello? We can go in and have a chat. Make his lips. Oh, look, he's still here. Yeah, he is like you. I'm not getting anything. So the bottle of bushes beside yours shouldn't just go up. No. No, you no. Watch. So it, it goes with whoever sees it. somewhere where it doesn't have a thing, right? No, 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 no. No, he's talking about like no, the same here, spot. Right yeah, put it right here. Nope. No. It's only on, because it's only on me. Oh, oh there it is. Okay. So it is on me. It is this right. Check his GoPro. Would it no no? It's literally specifically like it was on your side. Oh, phone. Yeah. Oh, let me. Airplane mode. Or you can put it in my bag. I mean, my phone doesn't go off though. Oh, because notification goes off. It'll light up. But it's oh. still going off. I turned it off because he had his own. I turned it off. Wait, well, that on. wasn't it. No, it's still going off. Your phone? No. Nah, yeah, it turned off. Oh, Did you oh. turn yours off? My phone's in airplane mode. My so nuts ain't gonna fit. I had to see if you had some radioactive <laughs> nuts there, you know? <laughs> yeah, you don't wanna be like Ricky, you have Stretch Armstrong down there. Nah, I'm good, I don't need my shit dipping the toilet. Alright, we're right. good. We gonna head upstairs now? Yeah. Alright. Come on, Bob, we go over Huh? Alrighty. Right. That camera. Are y'all going up? Yep, they're going up. Alright. We're going over here. Come back. I guess we'll introduce ourselves. Hello, my name is Tristan. Smell 
I don't push you, but you know. Yeah, we're not here to harm you or anything. We're just here to talk a bit and see if y'all are still here. What's upstairs? There's no floor. Right? Hey, Baldwin, this is Tristan. Hey. Hey. Did y'all hear that bang? What was that bang? Did y'all hear a bang, or was that y'all? That was a door. Alright. Thank you. Thank you. Don't let your panties get in the wall. Dick. I figure if I see something interesting, I may as well have it on video. Oh, you can't see shit in this room. <laughs> opening the door. It jumped to five after you finished your transmission. If I leave it in here and I step out of the room so that I'm not intruding on his space, if he is here, I'll show up. But it's not going off at all. You can go to the roof, go up the top, or you can go back down there and meet them boys. I'm going to try and scare shit out. I mean, we can, yeah. It's gonna be kinda hard to just help the noise of this place, I guess. That's creepy, Jerry. Let's go say hi. 
That's what Gardner was looking at earlier. There's a window with a big old hole right over here. <laughs> this whole damn video told me nothing but a big ass beep. What's the we custom this thing? Oh, I forgot. See, that's a. Uh, Alright, we just want to know you're here. Look at that. Can you close it? Oh, you're up. Did you open it again? Really good. Really good. All right. Yeah. Okay. Hey, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go check the door out. That's good. Check the door out too, because that was crazy. You mind if I come in? I'll stand around in the dark for a while with you. Why did it open like that? I gave you the CMA. So. Is there any mechanical shit on that? Uh huh. Hmm? Huh? Well That's all the way we want to see us yeah. in life. Pull the door open or something? Closer? No, it's got the. It's got the regular hinges on it. Yeah, it's got a hinge. Let it fall away. I'm gonna check these rooms out. Yeah, Just doesn't open. See if there's any like stairs that there's an upstairs up here. Any other toys about this upstairs? Hey uh guy. You never told us about this. Cause we heard a bang from upstairs. Cause I thought that... Hey Phelps. Hey, did he say anything about an upstairs right here? Oh, not these ones? We never came back here. Remember, we shut the door, but there's stairs right there. Well, we go third floor. There's three sets of stairs. Oh, so this one goes straight to the third floor. Well, I'm going to check back here because. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all go grab that board, please. That's that other door. Oh, that's that other door. I got that on the camera, too. As soon as it did, we just won't turn around. I'll look straight at it. Alright. Well, you know what?
We gotta go back there. We're gonna hold on. This light is bright. Yeah. I'll keep that up. Okay. I didn't remember seeing that at all. Hannah. Hannah? Yeah, that's not a good thing. I didn't see these times when we came in. Yeah. So Hannah? Say his name. Is there a Hannah in here? So we should probably go up on the second floor or the third floor so we don't hear him. There, there's another room on the other side of that. Too. Yeah, we can. I'm not getting anything anymore. K2. K2 hit something. Head to the uh, 
If you are here, could you knock on something? If you're here, knock on something so we can hear you. Can you close the cell door? We've seen it on video. We want to see it in person to see if it's true or not. Seen the door upstairs. No. Everybody said you're the 
If you're here, knock on something. Take a cell door, slam it. So the second largest pouch. And it's gonna be in a little pocket. Shit, right? No. It felt like, like literally, like I felt shit on touching my bed. I have a device to my right that's going to be able to let us hear you. So I'm hoping that you can uh, communicate with us. If you can, can I get your uh, first and last name? Just know that we aren't here to hurt you or harm you. We just want to have a conversation.
you showed yourself to one of the ladies that came here. Could you uh, do the same for us? Can you move anything? If you don't want us down here, all you gotta do is knock on something. And we'll leave. Where are you at right now? How long have you been here for? Can you knock for us or? Sit the first one.